Today, we celebrate the legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. So I spoke to some of the community to reflect on his legacy decades later. Now, we've got some difficult days ahead. During the civil rights movement, Dr. King shared a message that sticks with people to this day. First thing I think of is freedom and equality. Like he is the embodiment of equality for all. With protests happening all around the country over the last year, his message continues to be important. Everything he's saying is still true. Um, a lot of people think this, the civil rights movement ended after he, uh, after he died, but it, it really didn't. If anything, it really began. It really, he really kicked things off. So we go back and we listen to the things that he said, we can, it can still be used today. Elected officials like Representative J.A. Moore are doing their part to help Dr. King's dream become a reality. Uh, I'm committed to working with people of all races, from all generations, from all economic and social backgrounds, um, for the dream that, that King um, ended up dying for. To bring everyone together, Representative Moore believes it takes a village and actions speak louder than words. Actions. Although he was an eloquent speaker, it was his actions that led to a lot of the progress that we saw. But it wasn't just King. King was one man with one dream. It was the countless sacrifices of so many people, like Tim Clark and, 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 and so many Judge Matthew, uh, Matthew Perry and so many other people here in South Carolina. Some believe now, more than ever, we all need to come together. We have to find ways to come together now and not through lip service, not just with words or tweets or or in when moments are set aside for us to do. But we have to do it in our everyday lives when the cameras aren't rolling, the people aren't looking at your Twitter feed. Whether you're young or old, black or white, Dr. King has left a legacy that will continue to impact many over the years to come. Reporting from Goose Creek, Antonio Stinson, Count on Two.